Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Croc. In the last episode, I did the thing I was going to do at the beginning of this episode. And I was going to save that gobbo. So, we've got all the gobbo so far, we've defeated the second boss. Oh, not the second boss, the fourth boss. And now we're going to do World 2 S2 Ice Bridge to Eternity. And it's been a while since I've recorded this. So, it should be quite interesting. And I remember what to do with the controls, fantastic. That croc is amazing. I've calmed down a little bit since the last few episodes. I've recorded a bit of Earthbound. And it's all good. Oh, jumping. Oh, boom splat. And we're over here. Jump and get that. And just continue on up. That's so adorable. Let's move the bridge over here, you can see. I think that's what it did. I didn't really pay attention. I was getting all these switches and... Yeah. No, it creates platforms. Okay. They have platforms and the frame rate's a little bit... Ugh. God damn it! Just being as careful as I can. Jump across. No! How many lives do I have? I have seven lives. I yeah, it did move the platform over. Okay. So, as we continue doing what we did before. Yeah, it moves the platform slightly. No, it doesn't. Okay. No, I'm don't, ignore, ignore me, I'm just being silly. And blind. It just, it just makes these appear. Okay, so we've got one. Two, jump across the spin, jump, and get across here. I'd recommend, if you're playing this game, definitely using a controller, because... Oh, for goodness sake! Because, oh, well, yeah, if you're playing a game on a PlayStation, you're going to be using a controller, but I'd recommend using... For the first few levels, using analog, and for using the analog sticks. And if you're um, using a non-analog non controller, uh, you're probably going to have a better time with these type of levels than I am, because I'm using the analog stick, and the small platforms don't like me. I just noticed something. I play games with really good soundtracks. Sorry you've seen the same section all over again. Over and over and over and over again. So much so that the music's like just stopped. That happens, sometimes the tracks run out. But you get adorable croc noises. Hey, yeah, let's get over here and kick some butt. As you can see, there's a difficulty spike straight away. I'm going to be quiet on this section so I can do it. Shut up. <laughs> oh dear. This isn't going well. And get over there. Get over there, Croc. Get over there. We need to find this jigsaw piece. These jigsaw pieces are important for some reason. Thank you, Sonic Gameplay. Stealing Sonic Gameplay game. Ay, ay, ay. I hate ice platforms. I hate them. I hate ice. I hate it. I hate ice. Ice is annoying. Luckily, this is the last level in the ice area, so we won't be... Hopefully, we won't be seeing any more ice stuff. To my knowledge. I don't remember. So, continuing and get over here. And, oh, we didn't even touch the switch and it did it for us. Thank you, game. Thank you, game. You're very helpful. I want to stop and jump and jump and jump and jump and spin and jump backwards and jump run forward jump I'm just jumping on each platform to make sure I've got it and now we can 
Jump over! Yes! We did it! Oh, thank goodness. How many lives do we have? <laughs> we have... Three lives. It took us... Oh, jeez! Get across as quickly as, as possible! No! Oh, that scared me. That genuinely has terrified me. And we've got Dantinis, and they're going to be fire shooting ones, aren't they? They're going to be Satan Dantinis. Yeah, they're Satan Dantinis! Satan Dantini. Satan Dantinis, annoying. One, two, three, four. Jump over! Jump over! I don't need to No crystals unless you go to the other side and jump. Oh! Mm, hello. Jump over here, get the crystals, go and get out of there, crop. Get out. Come on. We can do it. Yes. Sorry, I had a bit of a stupid moment there. King Bombeard is an idiot. Yes! Thank you. We got some crystals. I'm not doing any extra stuff there is here. I am just getting that stupid jigsaw piece getting out of here because I have two lives. Oh, no enemy! Uh, I don't know what they are. I don't know what any of the enemies are called apart from the Dantinis. Really, because the Dantinis are the main villains, uh, obviously. Uh, they are the first villain we see in the game. Which, going by Bubsy logic, means that the first villain you see in the first game... Yeah. Oh, I like this music. Oh, there's the jigsaw piece. So, this is an area to get loads of stuff, so we got the jigsaw piece and lost many, many lives. But we have four jigsaw pieces, and we are in World 3! So, we've done all... Well, I'm not going to stop the episode here. We're going to do one level of this one, then I'm probably going to stop, because... You know, i got stuff to do. Well, I've got stuff to do recording-wise, so... Yeah. I got a lot of stuff to do. I gotta upload a video later. Anyway. And blah 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 blah. So yeah, um I am gonna go back to World 1-1. I'm gonna get loads of lives. I will be back soon-ish. So now that we're back, I've got eleven lives, which is all good. It's gonna do me. And we're gonna do this level. So we're in the first Level of the uh, sand world. And there is a r blue gem straight up. Dead. Oh, frustration is going to incur. I can tell already. Let's check these boxes first. Crystals? No. Two, I guess. Gobbo? Yeah, Gobbo. I would have missed a Gobbo even if I had done that. Oh, it's music, man. It's music. Awesome. Jump down and spin and... Oh, we got it. Okay. Back and spin around and jump over here and get over there. Come on, go. No! So how many do I have? I have one gobo and one crystal. That's fine. Ay, ay, ay. Hello. I spun! I pressed the square button! Oh, well. And if I get a game over here, it might be because of lack of practice. And because there's a lot of stuff I don't remember. Because Crook is a game that I played as a child, and when you play games as a child, nostalgia is blinding. Alright. Run! Jump! Got over! Fantastic. So, now with that, we're going to go through this door. Here's the key we need. Oh, wow, this music. Again. I think we've had this music already. That was my own stupidity. Oh, well done, Croc. And get over there, quickly! Let's take the long way. Because, yeah. No, seriously, come on! Who machine the right? 
freaking place, game! Thank you, game, and go back over here and get that. Fantastic. See, I don't know if I've mentioned it, but yeah, the enemies respawn, which can be a bit trouble. So, come on, Croc. Aye, aye, aye. There we go. Yeah, the enemies respawn, which can be a problem sometimes. Keyword sometimes. Not all the time. Two gobos, and I think we've got two crystals, and we've got the key, so with the key, we're going to have to go through that platforming section again. You know, the one I died like three times on. This one. Oh, whoa, what happened over the camera? Aye, aye, aye. Uh, jump over. Jump over. There we go, we got over. Fantastic. I don't know why I'm talking like this now, but never mind. Let us do this level. I'm King Bombeard, and we're gonna do this. Go through the door. Fantastic King Bombeard. I'm not gonna do that again, I apologize. So there's another key with a gobbo. And there's the key right over there. So what we gotta do... Get this... Death. And go over here, I guess. Jump down, spin around, jump right down here. No, drop down. Thank you. No! Croc! I suppose we could be really quick and sneaky and do it like that. That's what I'm going to do. And hopefully this is a normal crystal and not a coloured one. Because if it's a coloured one, it's going to... It's going to annoy me. I know it would annoy me, because games like to do that. And go and turn around and jump over. God damn it. Wait for the platform to respawn. Doesn't take too long, I guess. So, Croc, get up. Thank you. Croc, get him up. Now we got another gobo. So we got three gobos and three crystals. So, no coloured crystals. So, oh no, normal crystals. Because if we had the normal crystals, I'd be uh, really happy right now. But we don't. Get over and oh no. We had one. We had one, and I didn't know about it. You guys probably saw me get one. But I swear I only had... Never mind. Let's turn around and run. Get over there and jump, Croc. Jump! Thank you. How many lives do I have? Because there's two lives. Oh, poopy. That'll do. There's going to be a puzzle to do with this. Eh, uh, there is. I don't know what that switch is going to do. So we need to... Jump and get on that. See, it didn't do anything visibly because it put platforms underneath here. It's like that one earlier. So we're going to go over here and die. And do that whole section again. Are you serious, game? Do I have to do the whole... Are we back? I'm back. So, I've got all the gobos. I've done this whole level with one life. Yeah. So, as we know, we're going to go on here. And die. If I die again, I'm going to stop the episode because I really, really can't be bothered right now to die this many times. Bye-bye. See you next time. King Bombard. Bye-bye. I don't care. Don't screw my outro. I don't care. I'll be back in the next episode. And we're doing this whole level again for your enjoyment. So, thank you very much and goodbye. No, Croc, don't look at me like that. I'm sorry, Croc.
Gerard go, the laser clown, making that frown turn upside down. Gerard go, the laser clown, shooting them up and shooting them down. Oh, Gerard go, the laser clown.